What's up, folks? Avery here, back again. Another episode of Avery Sports Show with the new look. We got a lot to get to tonight. UFC 162, Chris Weidman takes out Anderson, Spider, Silva. But did the Spider throw this match? Is he done in the UFC? Wimbledon, Andy Murray gets his first Wimbledon title and the UK's first men's title since 1936. Represent, God save the Queen, Andy. NHL for agency. Guys going left, right, center, north, east, south, east, to the middle of Uganda, everywhere. You wouldn't expect it. Daniel Alfredson to Detroit? Say what? Nutty, 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 nutty times in the NHL when it comes down to free agency people. And of course, CFL, week two action. We gotta hit that up. Friday night, football tonight! Woo! And the Empton Eskimos get a big win against the Tiger Cats. And the Edmonton Eskimos get a big win against the Hamilton Tiger Cats in a rainy, rainy, rainy game at in a rainy, rainy, rainy game in Guelph. And of course, the Hockey Hall of Fame inductions. Who got in? Who didn't get in this year? Did I get in? Find out. Every sports show. It starts in Trace. Dos. Uno. I and what's up, people? What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Plant life, petunias, roses, daisies, pomeranians, tomatoes. Welcome back to Avery Sports Show. Got a lot on top for you tonight. As I said during the intro, Wimbledon, Andy Murray, the first UK man to win in 77 years. The, la the last time a British male won Wimbledon, the radio was still a new invention. TV wasn't around. King George the Sixth was the leader. He was the monarch of the UK. That is how long ago it's been since we've had a UK champion at Wimbledon. And you have to hand it to Andy Murray. This dude stepped up. He was down 4-1 in the second set, 4-2 in the third set. Novak Djokovic could not put him away. The number one player in the world could not finish off Andy Murray. And I know people are gonna say, but Avery, he's not really British or English, he's Scottish. Still, Scotland, yes, it's his own country, but it is still a part of the United Kingdom. So British people, you want to claim him as your own? Go nuts, he's a part of y'all. Have a blast, have a cheer, have a cucumber sandwich. He is a part, he is what you would technically, he's a Scot, but he's a part of the UK. An absolute great match, people loved it, and what this can do for UK tennis, for the men, growing more will be fantastic, I know. English men are not going to be great in men's singles tennis right now. The women in the past have been in the final before and won it before. The men's game of tennis has struggled. So what Andy Murray has done for men's tennis is monumental. 